News a second casino is coming to Park City today. The state racing and gaming commission unanimously approving a license to the Ruffin Group to bring a casino to town. Joe Baker has been covering this all week. He joins us live from the Wichita Greyhound Park, where this new facility will be located on property that's been closed since 2007. Mike Rachel, this is a day 16 years in the making for the Ruffin family and Park City. Behind me is the old Wichita Greyhound Park, but soon a new era and a new home for casino entertainment will soon take its place. Motion passes unanimously 4-0. A unanimous 4-0 vote granting the Ruffin Group and the Golden Circle Project a license to bring a casino to Park City. With the presentations, the information they provided during the, during the application process as well as during these three days of hearings, uh, overwhelmingly convinced us that they had the uh, wherewithal, the economics, the ability and the vision to be successful with an HHR casino. It's a day the Ruffin Group has been waiting a long time for. A lot of efforts by Mr. Ruffin over the years to uh, get that park back open in some capacity. And so uh, today's just a huge day for the organization and especially for Mr. Ruffin. 1,000 HHR machines will be included inside the three floor facility. The machines look and function like slot machines. These machines are set up so one can choose to watch or replay the outcome of the race they place a wager on. A race is selected randomly from a database of several thousand races. With the new casino coming, Park City Mayor John Lenhair says they'll feel the impact. We have the interstate that comes through with four exits, and that's a lot of people from other areas stopping in to spend their money. And we would like to have, you know, as much opportunity for them to, to stop and leave their money here. The Ruffin Group still needs to file paperwork with the commission and also submit building plans to Park City. They say they're excited. We want to start uh, the renovation as soon as we possibly can. We're excited to get started on that. All right, the Ruffin Group saying they hope to start construction on that by late next year or early 2025.